good. And all the time. Amen. Father, we give you praise. We worship you, Lord. Just want to thank uh, our daddies, our leaders in the house. We thank God for our president, Apostle George. We thank God for our daddy, Dr. Kos, and Bishop. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. And we thank God for our lives for being here because we have come to make our lives better. Amen. Hallelujah. Casting crowns, lifting hands, bowing hearts, it's all we come. Jesus. We have to bring ourselves under the influence of the Holy Spirit. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. I just, I want to thank God for all the elders in the house. I salute all my brethren. Those that are here, those that are online. We thank God for everyone. Jesus is Lord. But well, quickly, I want to touch on the Lordship of the Holy Spirit. The Bible said in 2 Corinthians chapter 3, reading from verse 13, it said, And not as Moses, which put a veil over his face, 
that the children of Israel could not steadfastly look to the end of that which was abolished. But their minds were blinded. Underline that. For unto this day remained the same faith on taking away in the reading of the Old Testament. Which faith is done away in Christ? Faith done away in Christ. He said, but even not to this day, when Moses is read, the veil is upon their hearts. Even though the veil is done away in Christ, when Moses is read, the veil is in their hearts. Then he said, nevertheless, when it shall turn to the Lord, the veil shall be taken away. Then somebody said, he said, if you turn to the Lord, the veil will be taken off. Okay. Somebody was thinking, okay, let, I have to go to find Jesus, the Lord, so that Jesus can take away the veil. He said, no, 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 you are not looking for Jesus, the Lord, to take away the veil. Amen? Amen. The Jesus, the Lord, took away the veil so that we can come into the holiest of holies. Amen. And now when you call me, you need the Lord, the Spirit, Hallelujah. to take away the veil. Amen? Amen. So that we can understand the will and the intention of the Father. He said, now, now, the Lord is that spirit. Somebody said, the Lord is that spirit. Oh, Lord. Listen to it. He said, now, 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 here on earth, in this generation, the Lord is that spirit. Amen. 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 The Lord is that spirit. And where the spirit of the Lord is, there is liberty. The Lord is that spirit. So the spirit is Lord. Amen. Are you following what I'm saying? He said, now, now, in this dispensation and time, the Lord is the Holy Spirit. When we turn to the Lord, the Holy Spirit, He takes away the veil. He unveiled the Father. Amen. He unveiled the Son. Amen. He unveiled purpose and plan. He unveiled strategies Amen. that we need. For the next level. Amen. And I trust that we have come together. The Spirit has been unveiling things. Amen. And He will unveil more Amen. to the glory of His name. Amen. And Father, I will say, more and more, take away every veil yes, from our heart and mind. Veil of religion, veil of tradition, veil of human will and self, veil of human agenda and flesh. Lord, take away the veil that we may see plainly. In Jesus' glorious name we pray. Amen. Thank you very much. Let's appreciate God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah.